Life before Bali. What is life? Well, to others, it looks different, but to some, it's being, being alive, perhaps finding your purpose, your will, and most importantly, your why. So let's go back to 2020 when the world was crumbling. Sudden outbreaks, riots, businesses shuttering their doors, complete chaos. So I bought a drone. The world coming to a halt, I started exploring. I wanted to see the world from a different perspective, from visiting more national parks, outdoor art installations, traveling to other countries. I knew this was just the start. Fast forward to 2022, I bought an FPV drone, lost some friends, like almost all of them actually, yet grateful for new ones and the ones who stuck around. Those are the ones that matter. I had a vision, a creative direction I needed to embark on. So I did what most wouldn't do. I sold all my things and moved to Bali. But not before I had to say goodbye and cut ties with someone who I haven't talked about. And well, that was my best friend. Sadly, not everyone you start with is who you finish with. It's okay to have different views and opinions, but everyone moves differently. So here I am, moving on. Perhaps I'll share that story in another video, but then again, this is the story. Imagine heading to a place you know nothing about, as well as no one. Sounds scary, right? Because it is. It's exhilarating not knowing what's gonna happen. That's what makes it all worthwhile. Stop saying I wish and start saying I will. It's your time to take the leap. Talk about timing as the ticket's already purchased, then you notice someone you've been following on social media for some time is hosting a retreat? Hmm, I wonder where it is. No way. None other than the island of gods, Bali, Indonesia. Is that a coincidence? Fate? I don't know what? what's the outcome. But Who knows? I know but I applied. The outcome that I had a Zoom interview and waited. And then, congrats, Eric! You have been selected from almost a hundred other applicants to attend our full-time content creator retreat in Bali. Time has come. Ties are cut. Ticket booked. Retreat is all set. Time to head to the city of angels, Los Angeles, California but not before I do one last interview. You see, I have a friend, we'll call her Baby. B-A-B-Y. Baby wanted to interview me before I left, and I figured, why not get an inside look to who I am before I left the country? So, lights, camera, action. What's one thing you would say to your future self? <sighs> Man, aren't you glad you started? You know, just because I think, I think now that I have started and I've taken that leap, it seems like it, 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 I am gonna run into some obstacles, but the fact that I've already said, I'm gonna go here, right? Like I want to move here or I want to achieve this, I'm already on the right path because I know for a fact that my answer will always be no, it will never happen if I didn't even start in the first place, if I didn't even take this leap you know what I mean? And I think now to tell myself, like, I'm going to suck. I'm, I'm, I literally am going to suck, whether it's at filming at first, whether it's flying, talking to someone on camera. It's, mm -hmm. it's not going to look good at first, but a year from now, imagine what that would look like, you know? So I think the biggest thing I could tell myself is I'm happy you started. Oh! Oh, oh. <laughs>